Hey, it's Dr. Gonzo and you're watching In a Nutshell. So the last episode I talked to you about what causes a mitral valve to leak. And one of the conditions that I described to you was a common condition called degenerative mitral valve disease. In that disease process, what happens is that the chordae or the strings that attach to the undersurface of one of the leaflets has ruptured or elongated. In that situation, like I've drawn here, instead of having blood moving in one direction, blood starts going backwards into the left atrium causing a mitral valve to leak. So if you paid close attention, you've already figured out what the solution is. Commonly what we do in these cases is that we replace the broken cord. And by doing that, we reestablish the kissing point of the leaflets, allowing to the valve to be competent again. And that's mitral valve repair in a nutshell. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.